What's up everybody, it's your boy Tishan24, welcome back to my channel. Uh, last Friday, I dropped a quick video regarding Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 since launch. Uh, specifically for the PC version, there was a lot of discussion regarding frame drops, game crashes, and I kind of walked you through how to fix some of those issues. And since then, that video has almost 7,000 views, and I just wanted to make a part two, a quick update video regarding the PC version. So, uh, Beanox Call of Duty PC Twitter account, they are the official developers for the PC version of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Uh, they just tweeted out almost three hours ago with a new NVIDIA driver update. Now this driver update is hidden, you can't find this in the GeForce Experience app. Uh, you'll have to go through the Twitter account, they have provided a link which directly um, you know links to the nvidia website so i'm going to quickly show you that right now so this is the twitter account for the uh, developers uh at Beanox for the pc version of call of duty so i'm just going to scroll down here and you'll see three hours ago there was a new driver update and this comes directly from the nvidia customer care so once you click on that it's going to provide you with a link and again this is a hot fix to improve some of those you know, game crashes, flashing, um, all sorts of different issues, specifically for Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. So, uh, I tested this out for about two hours and I haven't had any single game crashes. So I'm just gonna quickly walk you through how to install this. So there'll be two actually hyperlinks. The one you wanna select is this one right here where it says click here to download GeForce Hotfix Display Driver for Windows. I'm just gonna click that and it's going to start downloading right at the bottom left there. Uh, I've already installed it, so I don't need to install it again. Once you install it, you're gonna click Express Installation. Once that's installed, uh, your shaders will have to be reinstalled again once you open Call of Duty. Uh, so just let that do its thing. Once it's done, I highly recommend you restart the game. The reason why I say this is because once the shaders were installed, as soon as I got into the game, uh, the game crashed. And so when I restarted the game, it worked perfectly fine. I actually saw a huge jump in frames as well. Uh, so I was getting later, past the past week I got about 150 to 180 frames. Now I'm hitting almost 200 to 213 frames and I haven't changed a single setting since the launch of the game. So there are some significant improvements in that front. So I highly recommend you install it. Uh, I tested it with a friend who installed the driver fresh on his computer. I made him uh, restart the game and his game didn't crash on the first uh, game mode that he entered after the update. So uh, just a quick tip there. Uh, apart from that, please let me know if you have any questions in the comments. Uh, I hope this helps. Please let me know if it has improved your gaming experience significantly since the last driver update. Um, so that's it guys. I will catch you on the next one. Hope this helps and have a great day.